Here with Louis from 100% Chelsea. I'm going to come and say this. The better team lost. I suppose they play well. I'm not going to give you a reaction. No, but you I'm do. Not I don't saying. want a reaction. I want to do you, do you think the better team lost? All, all the Spurs fans said it. One or two Chelsea fans said it. Well, obviously, Spurs, Chelsea. Spurs, Spurs played excellently. There's no doubt about it. But where they didn't exactly have the quality in the final third because they kept shutting us down, they were unlucky at the same time. Um, we, we play, we defended very well. Yeah. There's no doubt in it. You know, Ake coming inside, no one expected that. Fantastic. Do you think he needed that performance? The fact that he hasn't really played much since he brought him back from Bournemouth and now that Terry's announced that he's leaving, to kind of prove that yeah he can step into any role that to, to be fair he could not, the next Terry is a strong wording but when I, I say no 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 but I mean like, no but what I'm sure that's oh, what I'm saying like I don't that's that's how it will probably come across but I don't want to say that so I don't want to get slaughtered in the oh, comments yeah. but like where he's an academy product you know he understands the club he's playing he's played there he he likes it here, clearly he's stuck around mm. you know he. He, he wants to do something here, and he he has the potential to do that, and he's shown it today. He's he's absolutely phenomenal. He's brilliant. Technically he's brilliant. as well, he's a great play. He's great with the ball at his feet. He he was putting some tackles in. So there was one on the edge of the box as well where he brought he swung round, got it, and just shifted it out. It's f absolutely fantastic. I think you know he's he's got potential. He's got a lot of potential. Um, you know, but he, let's, we've got to see how that goes. You've got to see how that progresses. Um, I think when you're saying about Spurs being the better team potentially. Overall, their first team squad, fantastic. But for us, it was it was a fantastic tactic. It was some good tactical nows for Conte to go, right, I'm not going to start Hazard or Costa. Because let's be honest, realistically, if someone said it to me and I hadn't thought of it, because obviously I was scratching my head when they weren't starting as well. They said they probably set up to stop Hazard and Costa. Yeah. Yeah, well, yeah, you, you would. To an extent, I, I don't think they would have man-marked him like um, Mourinho got Herrera to do, but they would have been preparing for Hazard. I think Costa may be a bit less because... I think he could have dropped Costa easily. Costa hasn't really played well in yeah. 2017. Um, but yeah, it was definitely good tactically. In hindsight, at, when you saw it, were you more were you worried, I would say? Of course that I was worried. Yeah. Of course I was worried. I, I think I was, when I, it, hindsight, like you said, beautiful thing. But when you're going into the game, you're seeing you've got a guy that hasn't started in Bashway. Willian, even though he's great, he hasn't really started either. And like I, I don't think he had a great game either. And I've, when he, I know, you know he got the two goals. Brilliant. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's, maybe, it's a free kick. And William, we know he's brilliant at free kicks. And that one's a penalty. Not a penalty that he won. Because when he came off, some Chelsea fans were like, why are you taking off William? I was like, well, Pedro's played better. That's why he kept, so Pedro, I'm saying yeah. he got the two goals, but he wasn't the best player on the pitch. Yeah, Pedro, Pedro did play better, but for, for, for me, Willian offered something different, which we haven't really seen from our team recently. You know, Warehouse has a bit of a trickster and he takes people on and dribbles in. Yeah. Willian was there just running, balling, yeah. getting it in. And, you know, he, he was just doing exactly what we needed, really. You needed someone to take on Kieran Trippier. You know, he's 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 a decent like fullback, but he's not exactly, he's not amazing, is he? He's not even better than Walker, I don't think. No, he's not better than Walker. But I mean, for him to have to deal with that and just constantly running at you, it's going to always cause a problem, hey, isn't it? So do, do you think that... That's why we win. Hey, We're not Arsenal. Day. We deliver. <laughs> do you think the difference today was obviously the bench yeah. as well as the manager? Because Poch had Son playing left wing back. And I think that for me was a, That's a, bad a, a decision. terrible decision. Not just a penalty, but he's not a defender. Yeah, I mean, he, he was obviously trying to set up for... You know, three four three to try and mirror us again, as he did at the lane, where it was absolutely, it was you know he he set up fantastically and he obviously caused issues doing that. You know, it, 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 they they caused us problems there. But this this time we were prepared. We we came with a different tactic, and in the end, that's clearly what that's what won out. Um, obviously now he's got to focus. We have got to look forward now rather than sort of say you know this game was fantastic. We need to build on it. Well, everyone going to the game, but all I heard was, if Tottenham win then they might be able to catch Chelsea yeah. in the league. Yeah. They didn't win, they've lost. Do you, would, do you think this game would have a massive impact on the league, even if it went Tottenham's way? I don't. I think the fact, I think it's two different, two different competitions. The running you've got, you're not, you don't have to play Tottenham. You've got Hull, I think, Crystal Palace, teams like that. That's true, that's true. I think, I think for us, it's a case of, even though we have that running, like you're saying, psychologically, this game will play a huge factor. We were, you know, we, we, we've won the game, we've come out on top, and not to not tell, but like there's been a, you know, a goal that goes top gins and you can't stop that. Stop gins, top bins, and you can't stop that. You know, that's always going to cause cause an issue, isn't it? That's going to be something where you're going to be sat there going, okay, so I couldn't do anything about that, but now we've lost this game. That's going to be going not like through, not potentially through the Tottenham team's head. Tottenham are going to be psychologically damaged. It was a semi-final. It's a 7-1 they've lost on the bounce, apparently, as well. So, you know, it's, that's, that's huge and as well. They're supposed to be playing here um, next season and they can't seem to buy a win, win at Wembley. You're four points clear in the league, mm -hmm. in the final. Yep. The double is on. You obviously, you know, the double's on. You know exactly. What but who? Well, no, we call, like a few weeks ago at Stamford Bridge, me and Ramon said league's over. So forget that. League's done. You've won that. 
Who do you want in the final to complete the double? Arsenal. Of course I want Arsenal. Is it why? Do you want them because you think Man City will trouble you more or you just want to put Wenger and Arsenal in the grave? Put Wenger in the grave, basically. <laughs> and then be able to go to Robbie and just do that. And just go, ah, ha, 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 ha. But no, I mean, for, for us, I, just, I think Arsenal probably would be a bit, bit easier. No, no offence, Arsenal fans. But, you know, Arsenal would... You could borrow Herrera off us and man Mark ha- um, Sanchez out again. I, I like Herrera. I mean, I think Herrera is a fantastic... Well, put, put Kante on Sanchez and the game should be over, isn't it? Oh, man. Who knows? It's, it's going to be interesting to see what happens. <laughs> but, yeah. But, um, I think, you know, I'd like to get Arsenal's final. Obviously, we like I said, take each game as it comes. Um, we've got to play... You've got to play the rest of the league out. Four points isn't a lot. Southampton, we've got Everton and West Brom still to play as well. West Brom away is tough. There's, there's no doubt about it. Yeah, Everton is away as well, isn't it? Because you beat them 5 nil. away as well, yeah. exactly. So they're, and they're, they're going to be batting for blood as well. And they've, they've, they've been fantastic. They've won the last seven or eight games on the bounce, I believe. Um, yeah, apart from the injury, At Goodison Park, they've been yeah, pretty, pretty good. But final question. Obviously, Costa didn't start today. Bashu, I did. Yep. A lot of talk about China back in for Costa. The likelihood is that he's probably going to leave in the summer. Yeah. You're playing Everton soon. The man up front for them is Lukaku. Do you want to see him back at Chelsea? Yes, hundred yeah. percent. If if we're being offered 120 million for Costa, who hasn't been like you said, hasn't been good in 2017. Uh, he came on today. He did cause problems. However, he was very. He was just arguing again. And for for, for me, I want someone who's going to be there, get the ball on the turn, hit it. Look, Lukaku's no. There's no one better than him at that. He gets a, you, did, you, did you see the thing on Soccer AM by any chance? Like, okay, so he, he was holding Jamie Carragher off. Does that turns in every time? Well, was that was every that time. when Carragher went to Everton? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, and, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, and then and then and then he did it against Burnley. The other oh, game after. Yeah, so you know he, he proves he's proven a point. He can do that. Obviously, his first touch isn't great. He's young. He can develop. I think he's getting better. It's getting better. He can, he's, he can develop. But for me, Costa, 110 million. <laughs> yeah, go. See you later. I, 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 for me, Costa, he's a great player when he wants to be. Yeah. But he, he's not he's not someone I'd miss. Yeah. Like, he'd go, I'd be like... I mean, there's other, there's other strikers out there and possibly better strikers out there. So. Yeah, exactly. There are better strikers out there. There's no oh, doubt. I mean, in terms of what Chelsea can go, you're not necessarily going to get Suarez, are you? Yeah. Watch me. No, no, no. We're, <laughs> no, we won't get Suarez. I'm sorry. No, no, I'll go bad. Uh, no, but... Um, yeah, we, there's, there are a lot of better strikers out there and we need to be able to harness them and go to them um, and potentially try and get them. Lukaku would be who I want. I mean, for me, when everyone's talking about Sanchez, I mean... Come on, like Atletico, we, I, for me, Atletico Madrid have got Griezmann, who's a fantastic player. They say I'm 70 million for Sanchez. So, so, I can't speak. What's going on today? Too, you're too, too excited. Too excited. No, but um, if, if 70 million for Sanchez, why do that when you can just get that 70 million and give him Costa as well? Yeah. He's probably what, 35 million pound player, maybe? Yeah. Just 35, 40? Okay, guy, okay, okay, we'll give you 110 million uh, for Griezmann. <laughs> hey, okay, yeah, sure. Griezmann, uh, Pedro, Hazard. That's better than Hazard Costa Pedro. I'm sorry, all day, every day. I, I, I think that could be potentially something which we could look at. Um, obviously, it probably won't happen. I've got, I've got a football manager and FIFA in my brain because <laughs> I'm happy and you know I want to see how, we, how it goes and that, what we can do. Um, but yeah, it's, it's going to be a uh, going to be huge to see to see if we can harness that and see how we can move forward going in the league and in the in the cups as well. A very very happy Louis here semi final day at Wembley. Subscribe to Neat Sports, subscribe to 100% Chelsea. All the information is going to be in the description. That's it from us here at Wembley. Bye, guys.